Gordon Ramsay, 56, began his career as a chef working as a pot washer and worked his way up to the very top of the ladder. The chef opened up about his early experiences in the kitchen with Spencer Matthews on the Big Fish podcast, where he paid tribute to his mentor and brother Marco Pierre White. Gordon recalls how a 24-hour shift at his pot washing job was the breakthrough he needed and as soon as he clocked off, he went straight to a phone box and gave rising star Marco a call. I phoned him and told him that I was a talented chef and he asked to see me, Gordon told Spencer. I knew Jack has tea, I thought I was, talented, I thought I knew something. So I went to see him and that's where this whole journey really started. Gordon then opens up about how Marco pushed him to his best, admitting that he would beat the ST out of me, in a nice way, where you get elbowed and pushed and shoved, that's how you learn. Read more, Gordon Ramsay wanted to disappear after brutal career blow the chef said, I think, Marco, saw a bit of himself in me. He was such a mentor, he knew how important mum was to me and he understood how bad my little brother's addiction was. I knew what I wanted but I hadn't found the right person yet and Marco was like a big brother, Gordon said. After working his way up to be White's sous chef at his iconic restaurant Harvey's, Gordon's golden opportunity came at 22 years old and he was tasked with running the restaurant for two days after Marco's then wife Alex MacArthur had an accident. Don't miss! Gordon Ramsay on his brother's addiction, were 14 months apart, reveal, Gino DeCampo on Gordon and Fred moments that can't be shown on TV, Insight, The Incredible Gordon Ramsay Recipe for Light and Fluffy Pancakes, Explainer, Alex broke her leg or her arm and Margot said, I'm not going to be back for two days, so you're running the restaurant, Gordon says. He recalls turning up to the Wandsworth restaurant and opening up, getting the supplies in, getting the team together and running it beautifully for two days. The minute Marco came back, he complained about everything, Gordon laughs. Not a single complaint from a customer, just from Marco, which told me that I had him. What followed for Gordon was a stint at Gavroche, then a three Michelin star rated French restaurant described as a mecca that every sort of talented chef in Britain had been through. But only after Marco held on to him for a year longer than planned. Marco got me into Gavroche, he said you got it, we got you a job but you have to wait a year. I said OK Marco, another year and I put my head down and worked hard. Gordon reflects that on his first day at Gavroche, he was told that there was no waiting list. He kept me there for another year and lied to me about the job at Gavroche and I'm just working that out. Marco is a clever, clever man. It's only been upward from there for Gordon, as he prepares to open his 72nd restaurant, a street burger restaurant in Seoul, South Korea. Gordon Ramsay's interview on Big Fish with Spencer Matthews is available to listen to now wherever you get your podcasts.